everybody, my name is Sonic and welcome to Killing Floor 2's Halloween Seasonal Event called Grim Treatments. Grim Treatments, the Halloween event, holiday season, Halloween event. All right, in this, in this, oh, oh, Killing, excuse me, in this Killing Floor 2 holo, holo, seasonal event for Halloween, we're going to check out the overview, so let's check out I'm going to do a complete overview of the entire Halloween event for Killing Floor 2. It looks like, yeah, they got a new map in there. The entire Halloween event. I'm doing an entire overview over the entire seasonal event. So, without further ado, let's check out what there is. Let, let's see what Killing Floor 2 has in store for this Halloween event for this year in 2019. Alright, let's check it out. Alright, here we go. Let's do this. Let's see, what do they got here? What do they got? Huh, all right, let's see. Over here, look at the background there. Blowing up, yeah, as you saw in the background there, it's got like two pistols. That's for the support missiles. We'll get right in there. Yeah, see, these are two new weapons. DLC I just saw there. If I can find it, hang on. Ah, here we are, right here. Latest content update. There we go. This is it. Look at that. Killing Floor 2 Crib Treatments. This is our Halloween event. Check it out, look at those. Yeah, they brought back those Halloween zits. It's like an asylum. Yeah, it looks like a new asylum map for the seasonal event. Yeah, grim treatments. Oh, and here's that video, here's the trailer. Remember when we checked out the trailer for Packing King of Brass and Summer Seasonal Event when I did an overview? Let's check out here. Of course, you can see my reaction when I do this, so, all right, let's do this. Let's check this out. Here we go. Let's see this. Here we go. This is say it's just like an overview slash reaction video. I'm gonna check it out. All right, let's check out what they got here in the trailer for you know grim treatments. The guy down there it looks like a new costume. He's got the little hat on, a mummy, all the zeds in the background. It looks like an asylum. All right, let's see here. It's like a new map and such. This is it. Killing floor two. Ooh. Trip wire. Whoa. Ooh, look at that. Mr. Foster and his Ooh Grim treatments. Ooh. Ha, ha, ha. Whoa. Look at that. Ooh, snap. Ah, it's a vampire. Map Ashwood. Asylum. Oh snap. Look at Zeds. Yeah, it's a new map. Asylum. Whoa, bam, bam, bam. Yeah, ah. Ooh, new weapon, Rhino Revolver. What? New weapon? Ooh, Iron Thruster. That's like a lightsaber almost. Look at that, it looks like a lightsaber. Literally. Uh. Oh, they can a buckshot. Whoa, dude, that's a new weapon. So that's what that was in. Back in Kick of Rats, they introduced these earlier. Oh, that's like a, oh, a health flower. Awesome. Dude, that's cool. It's like a flamethrower, but for the medic heals. That's so cool. I like that HRG nail gun. Oh man, snap. Look at that, what? Ooh, nuked objective. Got a new objective for a nuke load. Ha! Ah! Outfit witch hunter. New so that's what Mr. Foster was wearing. That's awesome, Mr. Foster wearing that new weapon. Cool. Oh my gosh. Ah, look at that boom. Yeah, I hope it's not lagging. Oh, dang. Crown treatments. Little glow to crown treatments. Wow, that's a nice. Is not the man I had what is this? A monster, quite literally. And I must stop him. Ooh. Who was that? Wow. What a trailer. Girl treatments. So it looks like they got a new map. A new map. Oh, I sure hope it wasn't lagging when I was watching that there. Seriously, I sure hope it wasn't lagging. But, wow. Uh, infinite onslaught. Yeah, they had that's their summer, that's their spring season of it. Infinite onslaught you see right there. That's from Killing Floor One. Yeah, like Hillbilly Horror Halloween 2012. That was funny. Alright, yeah, that was awesome. 
We'll check that out. Excuse me. Why do I do that? Hang on. One sec. I can't believe I closed that out. So that was a nice trailer and such. I guess we need to go full screen. I forget to like... Yeah, okay. We're back in here. We're in two minutes. That was some trailer. Yeah. Quite a trailer. Cool. Real awesome trailer. Really. Sure hope the recording's okay after that. What about two real treatments? That was awesome. Really. All right. So you're killing floor two treatments. Yeah, I guess I saw a little bit of, I don't know, lag or something with the video. But all right, clip floor two group treatments. That was a nice, that was a nice trailer. So what I saw there, just from what what can I say about what we saw there in the trailer? A new map, Ashwood Asylum, and a bunch of new weapons, perhaps. It's a puffed half of the trick. New map, Ashwood Asylum. There it is. Grim treatment. Prepare for the tricks and treats in this year's ghastly grim treatment. Update. Wander inside the Ashwood Asylum and witness the haunting halts filled with countless creepy creatures ready to hunt you down. Ooh. Return to a nuke to save Kevin Jr. with the help of Nagdo Opana Uj Bayou. Thankfully, the Horizon Research Group has refurbished a selection of weapons to deal with the oncoming challenges along the way. You may find some spooky accessories to customize your looks for the Grizzly Grim Treatments event. See you on the Frightful Floor! Grim treatments. The cost oh yeah, it's a new spooky accessory costume. Yeah, sometimes it is best to keep things locked up. Ooh. <laughs> ah. Ah, so. Yeah, sometimes I get a little worried about my recording. Sometimes my recordings become unsuccessful. I was a little worried about when I was watching that video trailer if I was lagging. So this is one of the screenshots for the new map. It looks like the same style of that. I think I feel like I've seen these screenshots before. Yeah, the new truck. Went back when this was in beta before it came out. Before it came out of beta. Yeah, things like that. So, Ashwood Asylum, that's the new map. Complete, compatible with survival. Weekly versus survival and endless game loads. So, this map is available with all, th all three of those game loads. Clue versus survival. Yeah, one, two, three, four. That's cool. Dispatch Zeds while witnessing the horrors of the terrifying Ashwood Asylum. Oh, one objective map: nuked mercenaries assist Doctor Ogata Boyu in an attempt to rescue a young boy named Devin Jr. from a never from the remains of the destroyed city. Blood. Uh, I'm not Dracula. I guess I'm impersonating Dracula. If you can't tell. I guess. <laughs> That's what that sounds like with what, how I'm talking. Uh -huh. Yeah, alright. Okay, here we go. Look at this here. Things that go bump in the night. Things that go bump in the night. Ooh. Bump in the night. The quotation marks. HRG Health Thrower. With a field medic. An alteration of the freeze thrower that fires. A stream of chemical gas that heals players and poisons edge. I like that. It's like a flamethrower, but health thrower. Health throws health. That's cool. I like that. That's really cool. Yeah, health thrower. Yeah, it's like a freeze thrower. Poisons edge. Alt fire fires a medic dart for quick long edge heals. Somebody on Horizon asked the question what if we modified the standard freeze thrower? But you know, Made it for medics. Hmm. It's like made it for medics. Oh, sorry. That, I don't know why. Excuse me. I'll forget. Let's carry on. I was still doing the voice when I read that. Sure, probably shouldn't. Okay, whatever. The health thrower is the answer the HRG group came up with. This butte is fed off as a, fed off a gas version of the standard horizon healing. But it was pushed out a tube at high velocity towards whatever you want to heal or poison. Poison. Also, including 
also included standard genetic dots for those pesky friends who don't stay close enough to the hand. Hey, get back over here so I can heal you. Quit moving. Stop moving too fast. Like, ah, it's funny, you know? <laughs> yeah, you gotta shoot him from a distance. Like, we need to get closer so I can shoot him. All right, yeah. He knows to be healed. They're too far away. Trader price is 1,000 tosh. Not bad. Yep. This is like a mid tier cell. I don't know if people will say this tier. Look at that. Ooh, that's one of the new weapons. There it is. Fuck shot. Like we saw in the trailer. It's our G nail gun for the SWAT. An alteration of the Villad 1000 nail gun. Yeah, I love that. That's for the Berserker. Now they brought it for the SWAT. We'll add 1,000 Ilga. I, I get what these weapons are. They introduce these weapons as a little sneak peek of the, we got a We got a little sneak peek of these weapons since the back and brass summer season event. But now this is the, they actually reveal them in the Halloween event. How about that? You remember these at the end of the trailer and the previous video, yeah. Of the Villad 1,000 nail gun. That says, an alteration of the Villan 1000 nail gun that fires nails at two different rates depending on the fire mode set. <laughs> Both fire modes are automatic to allow for a string of penetrating nails. This contraption really nails the innovation that somebody was searching for. <laughs> Just not sure who. Or they survived. Well, there's a word featuring dual fire modes. Like, oh, sorry, that's the wrong, that's the wrong weapon. That's that's the fuck shots I was imitating there. It's a swat nail. Like, oh yeah, okay. Swat mode, yeah. Swat fire mode. Both fire modes are automatic. The swing drill. Oh. I forgot where I was reading. Oh, right here. We're featuring dual fire modes. Yeah. Fast firing, bouncy nails. Bouncy! Like, like the original one for the Berserker. There it was. There was a picture. Fire, fast firing, bouncy nails. And triple the fast firing, bouncy nails. Bouncy nails! Letting, letting loose three down rings with every shot. Something. Oh, something is going to have a bad day. Trader price is eleven hundred dollars. Just like the steel sink wheel or the what's his name? Cobbler or whatever. There it is, see? Oh that, that that's it right there. Nail gun PDW for the look at that thing we saw in the trailer. Yeah we did. Ion thruster was that thing. Awesome. That's like a lightsaber almost. Just looks like it to me. I'll cut through everything. Rhinos. Really Lord do. Look at that rhino. Look at that weapon. It's like a little revolver thing. A rhino? That's one of the new weapons, apparently. Like shot revolvers. That's so cool. I believe this for the support. It used to be for Gunslinger, didn't it? The original. I guess they're all modified to just use for another perk instead of the original health thrower. It's like a flamethrower. But it's more like the ice thrower thing, like they said in there. So, that's cool. I like, that's the pictures of all. See, here's the HRG fuck shot for the support, which we just saw a, a picture of. An alteration of the 500 Magnum revolvers that fire fuck shot shells. Quickly give, give yourself some personal space by unleashing these Akimo. Akimbo? Is a Kindle, a Kindle. I don't just say that right. Ugh. A Kindle, or at least double the problem away as you tactically advance backward. Tactically advance backward. <laughs> Quotation mark. Don't worry, we aren't asking any questions as long as you get the job done. Trader Press is $550 for single and another hundred dollars for doers. Rhinos for the gunslinger. The rhinos for the gunslinger, huh? This is a paid DLC weapon. Yeah, you got two paid DLC weapons. Like you saw at the beginning of the video. Before we actually check more further detail in them, like, you know, like we are right now. Paid DLC weapons. This weapon can be shared amongst players through our weapon sharing system. I like that. Yeah, it's nice. A set of scoped revolvers that fire fragmentation rounds. 
These rounds burst into shrapnel. Shrapnel? It says, whenever they strike is dead, what the environment. Trader price is $500 for single and $1,100 for duels. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what duels in here? Ion's Rust. Uh, what the Berserker? Oh, yeah. I love the new Ion Thruster thing. Seriously, Ion Thruster? The Ion Thruster, seriously. The Ion Thruster looks like it's a freaking lightsaber. Who doesn't think it looks like it? We'll, we'll see it in action once I check it out in the in a series of videos after this overview of Berserker. This is a paid DLC weapon. Like I said, this is a second failed DLC weapon. Yeah. This weapon can be shared amongst players through our weapon sharing system, which is nice. A mechanical sword that absorbs and stores heat generated by kinetic energy and friction. Each attack scorches zeds, and the stored energy can be released upon reaching 100% for a massive fiery slash. Trader price is two thousand dollars. Well, that's the most expensive one. <laughs> More expensive than all the other weapons. So that's that's all the weapons we even saw. The pictures here. That's the duck shot revolvers. See, there it is again. Health thrower. This is cool. I can't wait to try that out. Nail gun BDW. There's a slot. There's an ion thruster. It's like a lifesaver. I'm not kidding. It looks like one to me. Rhinos. There's a duck shot again. Yeah, I'll throw her nail gun. See, look at it. Does this not look almost like an, a freaking lightsaber to you? Kinda, but I don't know what's it supposed to be. But hey, pretty cool weapon. I can't wait to check it out myself. Seriously. Who you gonna call? <laughs> what is that? It says, who you gonna call? The witch doctor. Look at that. Who you gonna call? It says, who you gonna call? Not Ghostbusters. The witch doctor, mercenaries, I guess. Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> Ooh, look at that, that freaking costume. Nice accessory. I guess you get that when you get all the achievements. New steam achievements. As with Asylum and its collectibles, nuked objective game mode completion. Nuked objective mode completion. Time limited Halloween objectives, tickets, and cosmetics. So there's a new, there's a new objective mode for, uh, Objective game on completion for nuked. That's cool. The, the map nuked. That's awesome. I like that. Ashwood Asylum. Too bad there wasn't objective map. Objective mode for Ashwood Asylum, but eh, it's all good, I guess. I think it's a cosmic. We got it for four other mode, game modes, though. Ashwood Asylum and nuked Halloween seasonal objectives to earn the Chris Beyond Horizon Space Elite weapon skin. Gotta check that out. Halloween event tickets, Halloween cosmetics. That's everything. So we just checked out everything there was for this net. We got a call, that witch talker suit. Yeah, Zion thrusters, Rhino. That's cool. There's that new map. Yeah, there it is. There's the trailer again. Grim treatments, Killing Floor 2, Grim treatments. That's, and there you go. That was the overview for Grand Treatments. Killing Floor 2's Grand Treatment all the way to that. Let's check out. Let's check out this other stuff here. Find a match. Bring a match. Rouse you. What am I doing here? Look at, so, that was the overview. But, there's the seasonal achievements and everything. Yeah, here we go. See, like, here it is. That's the map, new map. Ashwood. So in my next couple videos after this overview, I'm going to be going in further detail of Elfer after everything we just covered in this overview. I'm going to do a series of videos like I've always done before us, our dude overviews. We're going to check out the Ashwood Asylum and Survival. Because uh, it's available on Survival, Weekly. I may do for Survival some, sometime, don't know when, but yeah. Survival, Weekly, Endless. Their Survival will be another time. That's... I'll, I'm probably gonna have to do it for survival and weekly and endless for the achievements if we check them out. So that's for that's for Ashwa Asylum. And in the objective mode, you remember Zed Landing, Steam Fortress, and Outpost for, for the what's it called? Back in King of Wrath, Summer Season event for Killing Point 2. Now they got nuked. 
our newest objective mode nuke we're gonna check this out now for that of course that's all of them that's cool yeah and here's those let's check out those achievements real quick here's those achievements i'm gonna be checking out through the playthrough of me doing a series of videos that's like i said i always do a series of videos to cover everything after doing the overview i cover every i go over i go in deep detail over everything i covered in the overview through a series of videos i play through and such so here's the asylum assault defeat any boss on survival hard or higher difficulty on ashwood asylum that's like yeah you know regular survival long-term treatment here's the endless mode like a bleak wave 15 on endless hard or higher difficulty on ashwood asylum see there's the endless mode weekly checkup god i hate the weekly mode oh so hard complete the weekly on ashwood asylum cleaning so that's the weekly for ashwood so i got to check out what the weekly is cleaning the wards kill 1500 zeds on ashwood asylum clean the wards yeah bombs away <laughs> so yeah that's that's pretty much one to get over time to kill 1500 zeds on ashwood asylum so pretty much we're going to be doing a whole lot of Ashwood Asylum just to get all those achievements I'm gonna, that I'm going to try to unlock throughout the series of videos. Because that's what I try to do. I try to unlock all the seasonal event achievements before the seasonal event's over. That's kind of what I do throughout my videos after I do an overview of everything there is that's new in the, in the event. Really. Yeah, and there's bombs away! Complete nuke on objective odd or a higher difficulty. Can't wait to do that new objective mode for well that new map that do the objective for that map old map new objective mode for that map so there you have it that's all the achievements for grand treatments a halloween seasonal event called grand treatment or killing Lord 2. all right that about covers everything literally i think that covers everything i just mentioned i mean oh uh, excuse me i've hit all right Excuse me, I'm trying to say what I'm trying to say here. I think that covers everything in this overview for the Grim Treatments Halloween event for Killing Floor 2. So yeah, yep, yeah, pretty sure it covered everything. Now, after this overview, I'm gonna be doing a series of videos. They're like a playthrough, a series of videos where I go in further detail. I go in depth for detail on over everything I just covered in this overview. So, if you want to check me out, check those out. You can like see for wait to see me do more videos on that after this overview. So, really, yeah, that's it for this video. So, yeah, all right. Let me know what you guys thought about this. This video in the comments below. If you like this overview, or if you like this video, you got to tag up that. Smash in that like button, like, ow! Ah! Ah! Oh, 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 or you can just slap that like button, just all that naughty like button, just slap it. Oh, no. that's so naughty. Oh, just, 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 just hit the like one if you like it. It's up to you, really. <laughs> yeah, or if you'd like to see more from me, or like I said a few minutes ago, if you'd like to see me further detail in depth of everything i just covered in this overview for this halloween event i do a series of videos after this overview of that go up where i try to get all these achievements you, or you can like see any of my other videos like any do more videos like this i do videos over other seasonal events or over my reaction videos and things like that you could subscribe really all up to you if you'd like to see me go further in depth over everything I just covered in this overview. Like I said, you can spread all of you. So really, yeah, up to you. So yeah, <laughs> so yeah, and with that said, <laughs> thanks for watching everybody. See you next time. Bye.